Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Queenie. For those who don't know me, reviewing Love Island Winter. Okay, this is Love Island UK Season 9, Episode 1. Before I get into it, please make sure to like this video, subscribe and hit the bell, and leave a comment down below. And I know one of the comments are going to be, how can we watch this in the United States or in another country? Well, I live in Canada. And the only thing I could tell you, if y'all don't know a bootleg way to watch it, is by a VPN. That's the only way I know how. There is a discount that I have in my description down below if you do want to check it out. It is for purchase. However, ITVX, formerly known as ITV Hub, is free. So create an account, use the VPN, watch the show with us. So this season, the guys are first to enter the villa instead of the girls, and I like that. You know, let's switch the roles a little bit. Let's add the pressure on the men. The villa itself, absolutely beautiful. It is gorgeous. Speaking of gorgeous, first to come in is Tanya, who caught the eye of Shaq. And I'm like, okay, Black Love, I feel you. Shaq has stepped forward. Tanya, what do you think of Shaq? Yeah, I'm impressed. I think it's pretty obvious to see why I stepped forward. She looks insane. Love at first sight? <laughs> who knows, we'll see. You never know. <laughs> Listen, Shaq said y'all are not going to catch me slipping, OK? I'm the only black man, this is the only black girl, and we're going to, oh, oh. We're gonna make it known that we want each other, okay? Y'all not gonna clown me out here in this black terror streets. Anime is next, and both Ron, not both, uh, Ron Harris and Kai stepped forward for her, and she picked Kai. Ron and Will stepped forward for Lana, and she picks Ron. Then things get a little spicy with Olivia. Olivia is next, and this is the first time I've seen somebody wear shorts. I was like, okay, this is cute or whatever. Um, so she's trying to be a little bit different. The last two single guys are Harris and Will, who both stay, um, stand up for her, right? And I'm like, okay, maybe she'll pick like Harris or something, because Harris recognized her, he's a boxer, she's a ring girl. Oh no. Are you a ring girl? Yes. I'm a boxer, that's all. I think oh, I've come across okay. I think I've come across your okay. <laughs> social media. I like that. Before. Kai. Kai, we've got a steal. <laughs> Anime, how does that make you feel? A bit gutted, but I'll speak to you later. So I don't know if it's because of this situation here or just how she came out as a person, but she's giving me bad vibes. She was giving me bad vibes at the top of the episode, giving me bad vibes throughout the episode. I just I'm not taking to Olivia. But anyways, she steals Kai from anime, which means anime is single, is gonna have to wait in the wings. But that doesn't last for long because here comes Tanya. With the body yaddy yaddy. The body yaddy yaddy. And she's like, oh, I'm gonna have my pick of the litter. Please step forward if you like the look of Tanya. Oh my goodness. But um, yeah, start, just gotta know as many girls as possible, haven't we? Yeah. Find out who the connection's really with. I'm gonna have to go with Kai. So, Danielle, you've chosen to steal Kai. Olivia, what's going through your head right now? I mean, it was sweet while it lasted, <laughs> I guess. You cheeky boy, Kai, you cheeky, cheeky boy. And you're lucky it paid off because she picked you. But you would have looked like such an ass. <laughs> like, such an ass. But it worked out in his favor. Kai um, was picked by Danielle in return. So, let's see how long this lasts. So anime picks Harris to couple up with, and then obviously Tenyel and um, Will are last to be picked, which means the couples are Lana and Ron, anime and Harris, Tanya and Shaq, Tenyel and, damn, what's this man's name? Kai, and Olivia and Will. So off the bat, Ron and Lana have been pretty solid since they chose each other. <sighs> Y'all who love Harry Potter, please let me know, like, what is the bondage that you guys are in? Because as soon as one of y'all hear Harry Potter, you think marriage. Would you buzz it? I'll step forward in that. Yeah, I was actually. Yeah. Did, did you have your eyes on anyone else, though? Not really. I like chilling. I like yeah. movies. Harry Potter. Yeah. Best ever. Harry Potter, I'm so glad you said it. I'm such a big Potter fan. Really? Yeah. Ron. Ron Weasley. <gasps> he likes Harry Potter, and so do I. Oh, so cute. I'm gonna need you to be released. I'm gonna need y'all to be released. They do talk later and we will talk about that and they have more in common than just, than just Harry Potter, but I'm like, good God. I'm also liking Harris's vibe. Listen, Harris, that, this man Harris does not play. He said, do not waste my time. Are you a relationship kind of girl? I, obviously, I've never been in one, do you know what I mean? So like, you don't know? Yeah, after three months, if it's not like a case like, wow, I can, I'm, not gonna, I'm gonna sort of bring this girl back home, I'm gonna introduce yeah. her to my sisters or my mom. 
but we still have a canteen. There are a few chats in the villa that he had that were basically like, listen, I know what I want, I know what I'm looking for, and if you are not that, sorry, <laughs> it's time to call it quits. And at first I was like, mm, red flag, like why not see something through? A lot of people are, 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 are kind of like, you know, like here's a list I already have, just plug it in and if you don't fit, throw you out. But a lot of other people are getting too comfortable in relationships and not asking the serious hard hitting questions to see are we actually compatible in the long term. So this man is giving you two, three months tops and if it doesn't work out, he's gonna cut you loose. The infamous Kai was oddly disappointing. You guys let me know if you thought he was as disappointing as I thought he was because in the picking, he was out here like, oh yeah, I want you, I want you, not a problem, I'm gonna give everybody a try. But now he's actually talking to Tenyal and I'm just like, oh no. This yawn was not planned, but it was perfectly timed. So you're younger than me. Yeah, I don't normally yeah. go for younger guys. Well, you know, the first time for everything, isn't there? Are you glad you're coupled up with me? I am. Are you glad you're coupled up with me? Yes. <laughs> well, I'm waiting for you to put me in my place. <gasps> It'll come soon, don't worry. <laughs> don't know if he's going to be trustworthy, but who cares? There's going to be loads of people coming in. She did say she enjoyed his conversation, his company, and that he was confident. Oh, come on, alliteration. But I was here just like, really? Because you look kind of bored? I don't know if that's just her natural disposition, but she, she looked very uninterested. So the fact that she was interested in him, I'm like, uh, okay. So Miss Bad Vibes Olivia. <laughs> no, I get, Elaine, be nice. It's day one. Maybe she's not bad vibes. Let me hold out my judgment, okay? Olivia had already pied Harris at the initial picking. But as the day goes on, she's like, hold on. I think I like him. Oh I God, really fancy Harris. I regret not like picking him because he stood forward for me. And he's really nice. Yeah. Oh, I don't he's trust him. He's been No, neither no. do I. I fancy Kai the most and then, and then Harris, Harris and then maybe Ron. Okay. Yes. Yeah, we've Honestly. definitely got the same type. Yeah, I think we do. That was purely just based like, off looks. Yeah, looks, looks is but like... But like, I'm vibing with you now. Yeah, yeah, And yeah. we can click. Yeah, yeah, I'm not, Maybe I'm not we just... keep a pact to not mention the age. Yeah. Okay. No problem. So here's another reason why I want to call this girl Bad Vibes, okay? Because she's sitting with, I think it was Anna Mae, and was talking about excuse me, was talking about um, Kai can't be trusted because he has his hands in too many pots. Are you not the same woman who's doing the same thing? You like three different people and so does Kai. Why when it comes to him, is he untrustworthy? But when it comes to you, you're just playing the field. Oh, honey boo boo, no. No ma'am. No ma'am, no sir, no ma'am. Double standards, we don't do that. Actually we do, but not in this case. The vibes between Shaq and Tanya. <sighs> Immaculate. And a breath of fresh air, I must say, because sometimes when, the, when there are two black people, it feels like they just have to be forced together because they are the minority, but it seems like they genuinely vibe with each other. Now we're talking about boyfriends. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, once you, once you see how I cuddle tonight, then... We'll see. Shaq is... Good looking, has been real, love the hair, the smile. So <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, if I'm being real, like, I yeah. couldn't be happier. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I feel like we kind of get each other. Flows, yeah. it just yeah. makes sense. It's, it's, it it makes just makes like, that's the best way to explain it. Like, it just makes sense. I feel like you're someone that I can just, like, that I wouldn't, like, protect. Oh, that's cute. You know, you know what I mean? Yeah. They, so the more I watch them, I'm thinking that what I'm sensing as like compatibility is actually the similarities in their features because I look at them and they kind of look related. And no, it's not just because they are both black. I literally see physical characteristics that are similar enough for me to be like, if they said they were cousins, I would believe them. You know what I mean? So yeah, for that reason alone, it's starting to get weird for me. Um, so I would like them to get more options and genuine options, not no, you know, um, filling out a quota for the Love Island um, racial diversity. No, bring in genuine options for these people because I want to see if they could venture out or if they're just going to stick with each other and build on the connection they already have. So Will, Mr. TikToker, the TikTok famous farmer something. I'm going to have to look up his TikTok. I know I said that last time, but I'm going to look it up for real this time because you would think somebody who popped off on social media maybe will have a better time in 
you know, a social setting, not so much. He's not really connecting with the women. Um, he is a funny person, they acknowledge that, but they're seeing him more as a friend. And the funny guy typically is a sleeper because one, yes, they could be categorized as like, mm, maybe he's too friendly, I'm not really feeling sexual tension with him. Or they could laugh your ass off so hard that them panties be falling. And you know it's true. A lot of y'all have fallen for a funny guy. <laughs> It happens to the best of us, I promise you. But he needs to step up his game because Maya shows up at the end of the episode saying that a new bombshell has been voted in by the public. I'm Tom, I'm 23 and I'm a footballer of Barnsley and I'm definitely going to be scoring some goals in the villa. <laughs> so I've been single for three months now. I'm a very confident guy. Being six foot five, girls seem to love that. Going to Villa, I am going to go in for a one. Maybe the guys might feel a bit intimidated. Maybe they might feel a bit under pressure that I'm going to take the missus or something. I don't know. So what they neglect to mention is the three months of his singleness was followed... No. Was pre... Child, what is the word? He was in a 3.5 year relationship before being single for three months. That's what I'm trying to say. So the single for three months... If it was a short relationship, I'd be like, oh, okay, no big deal. Three and a half years? Three and a half years. This man is wasting our time. You are wasting our time. But you know what? I hope it works out for you. I hope you find a lady in here and you take her seriously because right now it's giving F boy. That's all I have for you guys today. Also, this is going to be a daily review if you don't know. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and let's get to chatting.